Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can tell by the state of this video, we are going to be doing my craft corner tour um, that I have been talking about filming for forever now um, because I got a new desk and since I got that new desk, I have changed everything around and gone through a bunch of my stationery and I just wanted to give you an updated tour. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and get started. So to start this video off, my desk I got from Facebook Marketplace, but I'm pretty sure you can buy it on Amazon and Target and Walmart. Um, it's just a simple corner desk that connects right here um, with just some like little wood things. Um, but yeah, it fits really nicely in this space. So I just thought it was perfect. Um, so my chair, I'm pretty sure it's also from Amazon. I'm going to try to link everything I can down below for you guys, but if I miss anything, just let me know. Um, that little bag is like, I don't really use it anymore. It's like my Bible study tote bag thing, but I really haven't touched it in a while, which is not good, but <laughs> life happens, you know? Um, and then we'll just start from the bottom and then work our way up. So as you guys can tell, I have my little trash can um with all like for all my trash <clears throat> um so down here on my bottom shelf i just have paper pads 12 by 12 sticker sheets that like can't really put anywhere um and then my sticker binder which i do want to show you guys at some point like a more in-depth video but it's literally just all my stickers um and i have gone through them and organize them ah it's like slipping um and organize them a lot better because it used to be a hot hot mess but um now i just i have all my stickers in here so i would like to show you guys this more in depth um but that is not a part of this video but this binder is from staples it's so cute florally um and then don't mind the i need a sweep so don't mind the stuff on the floor um, these two containers are from Walmart and the bottom one is full of like my seasonal stickers. So like I have Christmas vinyls in there, Halloween vinyls in there, you know, all the seasons. Um, it just makes it a lot easier for storage purposes, especially, you know, up on my desk. I have all my stuff that I use all the time. So, um, and then the top container is like tools, refills, tick, tick tacks, thumbtacks, binder clips, um, tape, that kind of stuff. And then I have a clipboard and a paper cutter. So very fun. <laughs> Back there on the second shelf. Oh, by the way, this is, we got our floors redone. So this is cement dust, which I still have yet to wipe down everything. It's just, I keep finding dust everywhere <laughs> and there's a dust bunny right there, I think. And no, that's a piece of wood. Okay, or like that's a part of the pattern over the floor. Okay, anyways, so back there is my Canon selfie photo printer I got for Christmas a couple years ago. That is another sticker storage, which isn't as full. I just realized that, like, or while I was using this, which I think I got from Home Goods, um, that that worked a lot better because I could actually see the stickers because of the clear protectors rather than that I would have to dig for everything. So that is. Honestly, I don't really know what's in there. I probably should check. Um, this little container is from Five Below and it has just like memo sheets and sticky notes and large notepads. So there's that. Then we go to the top of my desk. So I have my, this is from Tuesday morning. I got like a long, long time ago. Um, man, I really, I should have wiped this down, but it was clean, it literally was clean. Anyways, um, so I got this from Tuesday Mornings by American Crafts, and it's just my my cutting mat. I use it to just protect underneath, you know, the surface. It's just my mat. <laughs> um, my water bottle. Um, and then this thing is from Amazon as well. Just my pen holder. It doesn't spin, which is quite unfortunate. Maybe I should get, like, a thing, put it underneath so it does spin, because this is, like, it not being able to spin is the most unfortunate thing ever. Um... But I have my scissors, my paper cutter, Tombos. Um, these are all pens back here. Mild liners. Um, uh, my tweezers sit up here. Oops. My tweezers sit up here. Um, and this one I have like a lot of random stuff. I have a Sharpie. This 
brush pen, a whiteout, a paper corner trimmer, a little glue pen in here. And then in here is kind of miscellaneous. I have markers over here. I guess that's not really miscellaneous. That's right over there though. Um, markers and then over here is miscellaneous. I've got all kinds of weird pens over here. Pens and markers and yeah, just a mess. Um, then right here is sort of like my took my my current stuff so this is my little journal pouch i got this off amazon it just has sloths on it and it has three compartments i love this thing this is my current journal which i know i just uploaded <laughs> i just uploaded a video and i literally was showing you guys my new cover but in my next video i'll have a journal flip through and i'll explain why i switched covers but as of right now we're showing you a tour um, and this is, actually I got this today, I need to take that off, but I think I might use this for like my school, but um, it's just the planner that I got from Walmart for like seven bucks, but it goes, it starts in July and it ends in June of next year, so, but it seems pretty good. I think this would be a really good layout for my school stuff, so that's why I got it, but it's also like so pretty, so... Um, and then this is, um, obviously a little, I'm going to sit down so I can show you guys better. Um, okay. So this is obviously a little three little drawer that I can find you guys on Amazon. Um, but in here I just have my stickers. So up here, the top drawer has like all my favorite, favorite stickers, like my stickers that I would decorate with journals, put in, um, like in pockets for decor or even just decorate my journal spreads with. The middle one also has a lot more stickers, um, sort of just more random ones. Um, yeah, there's all kinds of stickers in here, to be honest. It's a mess. And then the bottom one has more sticker sheets, like um, just plain old sticker sheets that are ripped out from journals or, I mean, sticker books or, honestly, I don't really even know, but just a bunch of sticker sheets. Um, and then sitting above it is a little basket that I got from Tuesday morning and in here I really I really this is stuff that I didn't really know where else to put so I just put them together so I have my sketchy chicks little paper pad um, my reusable sticker books and then this little pouch from Walgreens that I got on sale and it just has my tape in it and a little stapler and a paper clip so and then in this little drawer I got on Amazon, it was little acrylic drawers. The bottom one has journaling cards, uh, mostly journaling cards. And then other, like these are little random, like encouraging notes, just mostly journaling cards. And then above it is smaller sticky notes and tabs. Um, and this basket is also some random stuff. I have my tape runner, some stickers, some more journaling cards, magazine pieces. Yeah, this is all just random, random stuff. So there's that. Very, very organized. Um, then in between it, I just have like a little pouch, um, that has a bunch of my pocket journal Pam cutouts. So... Uh, yep, and then over here in the corner, I have my ring light. Also got on Amazon. Have a link down below. Um, and then this is my washi tape drawer. Um, can you guess where I got it? Yes, on Amazon. So I have all of my washi tape in here. I love all of these washies. Look how pretty. I just I'm obsessed. Um, and then above it, I have my office tools bag from Target. And then next to it, I just have a bunch of sticker books. So these are from Barnes and Noble. This is actually not a sticker book, but I don't really know where else to put it. It's a Happy Planner pen pouch, but I have, um, oh, hold on, I can't open it, okay. Um, I just have a bunch of paper scraps in here. Paper scraps and other little like scrapbook, like when paper pads have those little scrapbooking pieces or whatever, I put those in there, so. Yep, I'm gonna close that later, okay. Um, and then these four yellow things are sticker packs that you can get at, well, I got them from Walmart. They're all on clearance. Um, so there's that. And then this is a Pip Sticks sticker book, <laughs> Farting Sloths sticker book. It's not just Farting Sloths, it's like Farting Animals. Um, why did I get it? I don't know. 
this container I found at Home Goods, um, and I think it's it's actually yeah it is like a fur office i found it in the office area um so i have all my sticker books in here so on the left side i have like american crafts and happy planner and my um shine sticker studio reusable sticker book over here i have Chrissy and designs and uh, paper studio or agenda 52 rather and then these are recollections sort of just big as the smallest i can see these are from walmart the pen and gear brand these are from uh these two are from michael's and this one is from dollar tree these are from scrapbook.com and these are back here from michael's so just all of my sticker books to my left that just works out the best that way and we're going up higher and we have my little cork board do i have anything that i need to hide on here yes okay so let me take off this is actually expired so i need to throw that away um my address is up here so let me just take that down okay um this is my little cork board wall i have a bunch of random stuff i have some pins i have some pinterest pictures um rulers and pictures and you know just a corkboard wall my grandparents gave that to me when they went to japan this is my delphonics pouch that just hangs off of it because that just works out that way <laughs> um okay so now we're going up higher so we got some shelves that my dad put up so this is how i have the camera set with my gooseneck tripod so i just have it hooked onto a shelf and it just bends and i make it perfect like fit right above my right above my head um so that is how i film my videos in case you guys are wondering um on this shelf i have like all my journal well that's a lie they're all they, every shelf has a journal on it these are all empty journals and these are completed journals well some of them are completed some of them are not but most of them are completed so but i just like the look of the empty to the full um, and then we go higher. This is a mini paper cutter. I have some watercolor palettes. I have a little mason jar with um, those Jane Davenport, I think they're mermaid markers. They're like watercolor pens. These are really, really awesome. This little bin is from Walmart and I just have like my old Hobonichi Weeks, my old Hobonichi of uh, A6s. Um, and the, this is a cut down exceed journal. So just a bunch of little journals back here. I have some chalk markers cause why? I, I don't know. Um, and then up here I have, that's my Moterm covers in there. And I have, uh, more journals basically. That's my rings. Um, that's my art journal, which is pretty much empty <laughs> and then traveler's notebook inserts over there and then the last shelf above i have this tombow marker <coughs> case which i'm trying to sell so if you guys are interested please please buy it from me i can we'll message each other back and forth about prices but i just want it gone um and then this cover as well it's, it's an a5 cover then i have a pen case more pen cases in that and then that has my canon selfie printer paper so that is all of my stuff um i feel like i actually have a lot less than a lot of what people have i could be lying but i did downsize a lot um i had a lot more and i went through it all and i gave a lot to my friend gabby and i gave a lot to um this girl that lives local to me so yeah but i definitely downgraded um, and then my mom's side is on the other side of this room and her desk is over here is with more stuff, but I'm not going to give a tour of that because it's a mess. So, um, but anyways, so if you guys enjoyed this video, then give it a big old thumbs up. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my area. Oh yeah. And my area has, or my corkboard has ring lights, but the batteries died. So, but it usually looks cute when they're sparkling, but anyways, anyways, okay. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed, give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.